I, Kieran, take you, Sophie, to be my wife. You are my best friend and I want you to be my partner in life. With this ring, I do promise to love you unconditionally and together make each day the best it can be. I vow to laugh with you in good times and to support you when you are feeling down. I promise to be honest, to share my feelings with you and to listen to you. As a family, we will create a home filled with laughter, kindness and stability. I will love you and have faith in your love for me for all our years and all that life may bring us. I choose you to be my husband, my best friend in life and to embark on a journey together through times of joy and the uncertainties of the future. I hope to bring as much happiness to your life as you have brought mine. I am happier now than I ever thought possible and my happiness all but come with you. No one is perfect but with all my strengths and weaknesses and with all of yours I think we are perfect together. I love you because you are so kind and considerate. You love me so well and you feel like home to me. I promise to always make our family's love and happiness my priority. I will remain right by your side through the good times and bad, in prosperity and in hardship, whether healthy or sick. May we always laugh together like we do now and may the trials we face only make us stronger. I promise I will never take you for granted. I know that we are not promised tomorrow, so I will love you every day like I'm going to lose you, and I will cherish you and what we share for all the days of our lives. Sophie, I give you this ring as a symbol of our friendship. And of the commitment we have made here today. And of the commitment we have made here today. To love, respect and care for each other. To love, respect and care for each other. Through good times and bad. Through good times and bad. For the rest of our lives. For the rest of our lives. Okay, you can safely put that ring on there, Kieran, I give you this ring as a symbol of our friendship. And of the commitment we have made here today. And the, com the commitment we have made here today. To love, respect and care for each other. To love, respect and care for each other. Through good times and bad. Through good times and bad. For the rest of our lives. For the rest of our lives. Thank you. It is therefore my huge privilege and pleasure to declare that you are now husband and wife. Many congratulations.
Sophie, as you embark on the next phase of your life, a new name, which I'm not happy about, <laughs> a new job, being a mum and a wife, I think everybody in this room, but I in particular know that you and Kieran are made for each other, absolutely made for each other. And on top of this, we have the lovely Olivia, our beautiful granddaughter, Olivia. You're a lovely family and a shining example of what's good in life. You really do live your life by old-fashioned traditional values and you can only admire that. Sophie, I couldn't have been more proud to give you away today. You looked amazing, you looked beautiful, you're a beautiful person, you made me cry. You've grown up to be a beautiful, thoughtful, kind young woman and I couldn't love you more than I do. And I know that goes for all of us in this room. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll give you the bride and groom. Six years to the day, on the August bank holiday in 2011, I met Sophie on a night out in Tanaya's with VK. Um, Smooth talked to her somehow, don't quite remember how. Despite asking Sophie for the time in the middle of our first date at the cinema, she agreed to see me again. We then enjoyed many Saturday evenings at Bradley Road where the love started to blossom. We eventually became Facebook official when it wasn't long until we moved in together. <laughs> become a special place for us. It's the place where we decided to buy our first home together. We got our first pets, um, Spud and Sapphire. <laughs> and accidentally started our own family. <laughs> Sorry, Olivia. <laughs> um, since Olivia was born, Sophie has shown how caring, thoughtful and selfless she is. She's been the perfect mother to Olivia, with a maternal instinct which impresses me every day. Olivia doesn't know how fortunate she is, but I'll be sure to remind her in the years to come. So, I'm not going to go into too much. The one thing I want to say is I just want to thank you for making my best friend the happiest I've ever seen him in his whole life. So, that takes some doing. Sophie, your beautiful daughter Olivia, I wish you all, all the love, health, happiness in the whole entire world. Please, to Kira and Sophie, Mr. and Mrs. Lockwood. Thank you. As a partner, she is considerate, kind and honest, but brutally at times. <laughs> <laughs> she encourages me to be more open, which is still work in progress, and has always been supportive. I'm incredibly proud of what she's achieved in her career so far. She reminds me of how lucky we are at this time of our lives and that we should not take anything for granted. This is why I'm so happy to now call you my wife and why I look forward to the years ahead so much. I love you.